Okay, so we're just 19 days away mm -hmm. from Christmas. Of course, one of the oldest traditions in Indianapolis is Christmas at the zoo. I know you said that your kids were counting down. Yes, how are they you are. guys keeping track of they, how we many? Have a little, we have a little thing on the wall that yeah. says this is how many days. I think I've seen that. I've yeah. seen you with a picture of mm -hmm. that, yes. So <laughs> how when do you guys change that? Every day, every day. How many sleeps to Christmas? Yeah, there okay. We go. All righty then. And they're doing the same thing at the Christmas at the Christmas at the zoo. 53rd year, by the way. Yeah. Uh, John Durant is out there. He's going to be checking it out for us in a second. But if you've not been out there, the light display out there at the zoo is unbelievable. And also, so I think the deadline is noon today. Mm -hmm. When you know we've been telling people to go out and vote for mm -hmm. the Indianapolis Zoo yeah. because they're in the running to be uh, the top ten um, for USA Today. Mm -hmm. So you know we have to put them on the map a little bit. And so we. Trying to make sure that we vote for them. And this is actually, we'll show you exactly why you need to vote for them. I think it's worth your while. So John Duran's giving us a little bit of a preview this morning of what's been happening there. I guess they're getting ready for the Christmas season, right, John? Yeah, and of course, I mean, inside the fan favorite right now, Santa's Village, where you got opportunities to meet Santa, take a look at his reindeer, also check out Mrs. Claus and what she's cooking up here at the zoo. Of course, tens of thousands of lights as well covering the zoo. Of course, it wouldn't be a trip to the zoo without seeing some wintertime animals, and they have plenty out here and active, even some opportunities to get up close and personal with some of the animals. It just wouldn't be Christmas without our uh, cold weather animals. We have tigers, we have sea lions, seals, walruses. Uh, we also have a new exhibit in our encounters area featuring Arctic foxes. And these are just beautiful animals, snowy white fur and really perfect for wintertime. We started all the way back in 1967 as the first zoo in the nation to host a holiday lights event. Event. We have been growing more and more since then, and really, you know, we think that we do it the very best here. Christmas at the zoo running until December 30th through December 30th, open 5 to 9 during the week, and stays open an extra hour on the weekend, guys.